Good day, mates. How's it going? My name's AJ, and welcome back to Elder Scrolls 4 Oblivion, the arena. Um, this time, however, we are not in the arena, and we won't be for a little while. As you can see, I'm back at one of the old Oblivion gates that I shut during the main mission. Um, I'm doing the side quest, Origin of the Grey Prince. To do that, we need to go to... Let me find it on the map here. We need to go to Crowhaven. We have a key from the Grey Prince himself. As such, it is our mission to discover his origins and find proof of his birthright. So, uh, I'll be back when I'm at Crowhaven and we'll get right into this thicker things here. Alright, looks like I've already found Crowhaven. Now, I'm just going to quickly say this now. I did lower the difficulty just a little bit so this does not take me 27... half an hour. And I'm already in combat, what the hell? Oh, skeletons, okay. Um, please go away. I didn't lower the difficulty that much, did I? I might set it back, actually. I'm so used to it taking a little longer than before. Right. There we go. Proof. That even uh, that after the th three videos I've done of the arena, that was too easy. Even for me. Alright, where are they? Aha! Whoa, that spike though. That's okay. Work on the archery. I want to get my archery back up because I think it's one of my main skills. Can I check real quick? Thank you. Alright, um... Uh, marksman. Yeah, it's almost leveled up now. Uh, what do I need to work on? Blade, alchemy, acrobatics, mark... Ooh, white armor. Hang on. Might be able to do that now. I have no pants. Y you hear me? I, I, I have no pants. I guess that'll have to do. I'm gonna work on my... Um... I'm going to work on my light armor, so might as well. Alright, I can't get hit that much though, because of it. Oh, skeleton! Oops, marksman increased. I said it would. Oh, real marksman needs some work, buddy. Oh. Why, why are you still doing that? Whatever. Okay, so, grab the iron arrows... Let's look around, find a chest, why don't we? And there's another one. Oop. 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 I'm using iron arrows as well, which might be why it's taking longer than it really should. But at the same time, iron arrows will probably bring our... That is creepy. Uh, bring our archery up, which is what my ultimate goal is in the end. Just get the skills up as much as I can during the arena. And in Crowhaven, I'll be doing a lot of sneaking. Now, I'll take the magic of potion. It turns out that those things are rather useful for me. Oh, parkour. Alright, let's get into the crouch. I look so stupid. But light armor is what I need. And I can't use light armor on this difficulty in the arena or I will die. Alright. I've entered Crowhaven. Somewhere inside, I will unlock the truth that Agronak Gromalog is searching for. I should be cautious, however. The fort has long since lost its noble trappings, and the presence of evil is unmistakable. Should I, like, just... Look, should I just do readovers of some, like, some stuff in an epic voice? I think I can pull it off. You think I can pull it off? I think I can pull it off. What the hell's that? It's a wolf! It's a puppy dog! Oh, it's a timber wolf! That thing is hard to take down. Slade. These things are hard to take down. Why? Oh, there it is. There it is. got hit twice there, once by each of the poppies, and as such, that's gonna mess me up. Alright, uh, I can't remember... Alright. Get 
back down to sneaking, and heal the absolute fuck out of myself. Uh, look around. Don't have enough magicka. Okay, I should be fully healed now. No dramas. Now, with this side quest, there is actually two ways you could go about it, but one will end up with you becoming absolutely buttfuck lost. Oh, sneak increased. Brilliant. That means we'll do more damage with the sneak, right? Oh, I got hit. I got hit, but that's okay. Now, I don't know how to put this. Yeah, because one way you will get absolutely lost, the other way is the way you actually do need to go. Which really, really sucks. Because when I did this mission for the first time, oh, this quest, sorry, I forgot I'm not doing shoot 'em up shit. Um, this quest took me forever to do because I went the wrong way when I first played it. Alright, come on. Oh, one more. Get one more. Change. Why walk when you can run? Has always been your motto. Now the miles of running and hours of swimming have paid off. You're an apprentice of athletics. Your rate of fatigue regeneration when running is increased by 25. That is awesome, actually. So, I need to level up. Like, big time. Uh, okay, so I need to find a place to sleep, perhaps? Alright. One thing I've always wanted to know, who the hell lights these torches? Why? Why the timber wolf? Oh, there he is. I can only just... I don't know if you guys can see him. I can only just barely see him as it is. Oh. What do you, what'd you think you're doing, Poppy? You get no bone. You get no bone. You get no bone. You get no bone. Um, I should probably check. See how my Akaviri sword is doing. Oh, dear. Already down to 73. Shit. Okay. Uh, where is my... There they are. Just keep... I'm going to keep restocking on those as much as I can. Obviously. Get my armor up as well. Uh, no more puppies, please. I don't like killing them. I like dogs. See, see, I like dogs. I, I don't want to kill them. Alright. Open door with Agronax. Mysterious key. So this... Is where things are going to get dicey. Okay. Okay. So there's someone walking around, and obviously, with all this stuff happening around us, that cannot be a friend. That's got to be a foe. Do not ever think that there is a friend in these caves, unless it's part of a mission. That is it. That's all you need to know. So, my biggest fear is that this is going to absolutely mess my whole playthrough up. Because there is something wrong with this guy. Do not let him hit me. Do not let him hit me. I uh, let him hit me. Oh no, 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 no. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? This ain't good. Um, yeah, that's Lord Leviticus if you can't if you can't see that in the corner there. And if you remember from Agronak, Lord Leviticus is his father. So Lord Leviticus is here and has probably always been here. But, if you take a closer look, you can see that there's something very, very wrong with him. Something is very wrong with him. So, we're going to go look. 
We could have avoided killing him, but experience is needed. Um, I'm so lucky that did not mess my whole playthrough up. I was actually really afraid I'd have to restart this. Just because... Um, if I contracted the disease he had, I'd be screwed. Uh, the Journal of Lord Leviticus. Let's read it. Oh, entry run. Beauty, pure and sublime. I think that's how you pronounce that word. That is the only way to accurately describe my love. The maiden grow malog. True, the orcs of Tamriel are often vilified by the other citizens of the Empire, and rarely would they be considered a pleasure to look upon. So, is my maiden Luktuv a rare breed of orc, unlike the rest of her kin in physical appearance? Nay. In fact, she is the perfect representative of her race. Green skin, muscular frame and all. But beautiful she is, all the same, for who am I to judge? Who am I to criticise when so many would condemn my very existence? I can only hope my love is as understanding when she learns of my unique condition, for I have yet to reveal that most precious of secrets. So already with just the first entry you can tell that there is something very fucked up with Lord Leviticus. Entry 2. Damn the politics of my station. Taxation and trade negotiations and meetings with disingenuous aristocrats. See, big words. Why? I don't want to have to think. It's sometimes enough to make me regret my birthright altogether. I spent the latter half of my life hiding my identity, guarding my secret. But now I am faced with an even greater challenge. For if word were to get out that I've fallen in love with a servant and an orc, no less. I would be all but ruined. Such is the life of the Cyrodiilic nobleman. So, obviously he's questioning his affection for Gromolog's mother. Entry 3. Curse me for a coward, but I have not yet found the strength to tell my beloved Luke Tov the truth. Perhaps it's for the best. For what benefit is there in her knowing? She would share all of my fears, but none of my abilities. Her life would become one of doubt and uncertainty. Still, if she is to spend her remaining mortal days with me, she has the right to know the truth. Alright, so, I don't know if I've already said it, but if you can't tell what's going on already, obviously this guy is immortal. So that narrows it down, and if you know Oblivion, you know exactly what he is. Entry 4. Joy and exultation, she is with child. My beloved Lutov is carrying my child. The midwives predict a boy, and we have already settled on the name, Agronach. In truth, I never realized such miracles were even possible, but the divines have granted us with their blessing, and so shall it be. I must wonder, of course, if my dear child will share in my dark gift. Only time will tell. Entry 5. Tonight, the truth will be revealed. I will tell my beloved Luke of everything. She will know who and what I am, and we will decide how best to ra raise the precious child that grows in her room. Okay, first word of entry six. Betrayal! Foul and loath loathsome harlot. How dare Luke to have questioned my motives, question the love I have for my own unborn child. When she learned the truth, that I, the Lord, Lord Leviticus, am no longer human, that I have walked Tamriel as a vampire for the past 200 years, how quickly she judged me. So, I am a monster, am I? Perhaps I should have proven her right. Perhaps I should have drained her dry when I had the chance. But I loved her, as deeply as a man has ever loved a woman, and I wanted nothing more than to bring our baby into this world and embrace my new role as father. Perhaps when Luktov has come to her senses, for she refuses to come out of her room, we can have rational discourse, discourse about our future. I do not, however, retain much hope. Alright, so how did he end up in this situation? Let's keep reading. Entry 7. Imprisoned! Imprisoned in my own home. While I slept, Luktov locked me in my own private chambers. She called to me through the doors told me of her plan to escape with our unborn child. She means to keep my baby from me. When I get free, I will find the traitorous whore and rip the child from her very womb. So that went downhill very quickly. Entry 8. Two weeks. 
Two weeks have passed since Luktov locked me in my quarters. Try as, try as I might, I cannot free myself. I cannot breach the doors. If I don't feed soon, I feel I will go mad. Entry 9. Food. Blood. 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 I need it. I need blood. Need blood. Entry 10. Dot, dot, dot. So, we've done it. We found the origins of the Grey Prince. And in doing so, we have discovered that he is the son of a vampire. That can't be good. But it looks like it hasn't had any repercussions on him, so not really much we can do about that. I can level up. I forgot that. I better go see if I actually um can level up by sleeping in this guy's bed. Where is his bed? Does he have a bed? Dear God, does he not have a bed? He does. Alright, we're gonna sleep for we'll just sleep for an hour. Alright, what can I increase? So endurance. Um let's see, agility governs the bow, and I think I'll go for strength. Yep. Okay, let's get out of here. <coughs> oh. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm so sorry. I've been feeling a little sick lately. Oh, I've been working non-stop. Like, if I'm not at my actual job, I've been here, working on videos for the next, I don't even know how long. I've been working on them, because I'm, hopefully I can start a new job in the next month. And I need to get as many videos recorded and ready to upload as soon as possible. For two reasons. One, I will be away for one week out of two, which means I won't be able to upload one week out of two. So I need to try and get videos uploaded twice a day, what, and get them scheduled to upload. Kind of a insight into what's going on. But it's it's not like it's no big secret that every YouTuber who has a schedule to fit their videos around doesn't do it. So there's no real point in hiding it, really. I, I don't see the point. But I digress. So yeah, I've been busy and. This chair has got a nice, firm butt print that fits me perfectly in it now. <laughs> Alright, so we've returned to the arena. We've got Lord Leviticus's journal. Let's break the news. You've returned. So, have you been to Crowhaven? Have you... What's this? The journal of Lord Leviticus? My friend, you've done it. This is wonderful news. The words of Lord Leviticus himself. Perfect. Ah, I believe I owe you something, eh? Here, let me show you these moves. Step like this, now strike. All right, now parry. That's it. There you are, some of the best combat moves you'll ever learn. Damn. You'll need them if you want to last more than five seconds against me in the arena. Now, let's see what this journal says. Huh. Ah, interesting. But... I, I... Wait... Can this be? But... By Shinji... I'm the son of a vampire! I'm no grave, Prince. I'm the spawn of evil. I thought my father was a nobleman, not some blood-sucking monster. I can't... I can't... Uh, all a lie. A lie. Well, that's not good. Oh dear, I actually feel really bad for him. Every time I do this, I feel really, really bad for him. What's the time? Okay, I'm gonna just stop right there. So, I always seem to stop in the same spot. I'm gonna move. I always, yeah, I always stop in the same damn spot. I'm gonna stop here. Okay, so thank you all so much for watching this episode of Elder Scrolls 4 Oblivion The Arena. So, we, have, we haven't we have done any of the arena stuff today. All we did was the side quest that... In my opinion, you're probably going to need to complete. So that's why I did it now, to get it out of the way. Next video, I'm going to see if I can do uh, the next advancement. Um, maybe if I can fit it in, get two advancements done. Other than that, thank you all for watching this video. And if you did like it, 
Make sure to leave a thumbs up and go check out links down below to the Elder Scrolls 4 Oblivion playlist as well as all my social medias. And be sure to subscribe, like, and follow. And as always, I will see you guys in the next video. Goodbye. Okay.